There's a long history of flooding in Congresbury and the surrounding areas, the most significant event being in 1968 when 125 properties were flooded. We had some major flooding in 1981 and again in 2012 we had what was hitherto a completely unknown flood risk area in North Will. Uh, where up to 200 homes were, were nearly uh, flooded. We at the Environment Agency have worked very closely with our partners, North Somerset Council, to deliver a community resilience programme. Community resilience helps communities by giving them the skills and the expertise to respond to emergencies at a time when the emergency services may not be able to get them to, to them immediately. That provides everybody with some confidence that these communities are going to be able to take care of themselves and allow the emergency services to prioritise those most at need. Well, Community Resilience North Somerset was initially established by North Somerset Council. But as it's grown and developed over the past year or so, it's become clear that we need a much more solid basis in the community. And that's led us in the direction of establishing Community Resilience North Somerset as a community interest company. As part of this, we've helped to introduce a number of innovative approaches to managing risk at a, at a community level. These include gully inspections and river level monitoring. Although these are specific to flood risk, they can be applied across a whole range of community risks as well. The, the flood team are working quite hard in the village. We, we've actually monitored and uh, mapped all the gullies in, within the parish, about 900 of them. And now we've developed a monitoring sheet and about three times a year we go around and we make sure that the gullies and the drains are all cleared, that they haven't got any debris or damage to them. And we work with, the North, Somerset, with North Somerset Council um, we work with the officers there and we also work with the Environment Agency and we monitor the levels of the river. One of the most uh, valuable uh, training uh, experiences we had was Exercise Coventina, which was organised by all the emergency services and the scenario was of the River Yeo overtopping its banks after a period of heavy rainfall. Being a community interest company means that we can develop policies and approaches that are really specific to the community. I'm able to give back to the village something and we can capitalise on the knowledge of the people who live in the village and we're able to look out for the vulnerable people, especially in times of difficulty, flooding and things like that. Climate change forecasts suggest that there will be warmer, wetter winters and more extreme weather events on a more frequent basis. This highlights the importance of having a community that not only is aware of the risk, but takes ownership of it and takes appropriate actions when necessary. Um, as part of this, it's key to understand the community vulnerability, and this is something that's been done instrumentally at Cleve. I heard Ian of North Somerset Council speak at a seminar on ch climate change and I really wanted to help the community to adapt to climate change. When I saw an article in North Somerset Life magazine, I contacted the chair of Cleve Parish Council and together we spoke to people, put up posters and advertised in our village magazine to get people who were interested to come to a meeting. So we're focusing on ensuring the welfare of our residents in case of an emergency. We've done this by issuing a questionnaire that enabled those who have resources or skills to let us know and also made us aware of where the vulnerable people in our community live. In the event of an emergency, we'd be trying to put those with resources and skills in touch with the people in need in an organised fashion. It's critical that uh, communities get involved in the, in the programme and communities like Congresbury and Cleve have been paramount in delivering that. I'd like to support community resilience for the future, not only within, um, within the Avon area but for a field and certainly the model that's been created by uh, Community Resilience North Somerset is very much a, a fantastic model to adopt um, in other parts of not only Avon but uh, the country itself. Mm -hmm.